Good day, everybody. Welcome back to Rustic Ridge Farms. With me, your host, Yilhelm. We are in search still of a couple of items, yellow and purple. Now, we are growing those on the island. They should be ready very soon. So that's all great. However, we have also gotten ourselves into a, a pickle. Can I say a pickle? Is pickled ginger a thing? It probably is. Uh, where we need 100 ginger in 26 more days. We already have 18, so I think we're doing pretty well. And that's what we're up to there. What's going on here? Linus's birthday. I believe... We don't need to worry about that. Okay. Queen of sauce. Roasted hazelnuts. Uh, we know how to make this. Yes. Delicious. Clear and sunny weather and rainy weather. Okay. The spirits are very happy today. Oh, you know what that means. I think it's a skull cavern sort of day. That's what I think. I love this. You're the best. I try. I actually like the cold weather. It gives me an excuse to get cozy. Ooh. Well then, by all means, let's let's be cozy. Wrong button. What did I... Oh, I grabbed the cave carrots. All right, let's grab a lucky lunch. Let's grab... I don't know. Probably health from outside. That's what I'm thinking. We'll get some health from outside. Get some more espresso in our life. See what's going on out here. What's this? Oh, a purple mushroom. Well, <laughs> that's nice. Thank you, wizard friend. I appreciate your your purple mushroom because then I can make another potion thing. I bet I have enough stuff right now. Honestly, where's that at? Little health potion. Where are you? What do I need still? Oh, a chanterelle. Oh, well. Oh. Oh. Ah, oh, forgot that one. There we go. Tink. All right. Taking care of it. I'm glad we found this second owl. This looks much nicer out here. There's fruit in here. Do I care today? No, I don't think I do. <laughs> I have simple standards. Okay. Grab this. Put that away. I suppose we'll say hi to all of our animal friends. We're not going to pick up their stuff. I'm just going to say hi to everybody. Mostly the pigs are the ones that were... Ooh, there's a five. All right. We're doing okay. Mostly the one that we're concerned with there. How are we doing here? 192 left. Okay. A new baby lizard hatched. Oh. Um... Okay. Uh, what was the name of that? There we go. Stanley. My chemistry teacher had a lizard named Stanley. I think it was Stanley. Okay, so now we have two lizards. <laughs> um, I don't know what that's going to get for us, really, but hey. I would like to have a, an ostrich. But if truth be told, I don't remember where the ostrich egg is. <laughs> I know it exists. I just don't remember where it exists. It's on the island somewhere. Um, and that's the best I could tell you, really. Good morning, kitty cat. All right, let's give you some water. There you go, have some water. Enjoy your water. Getting close to the time where... Whoops. We can go over to the Skull Cavern. Uh, where's all my bombs? Where did we put... Here's the bombs. All oh, the bombs. Yes, the bombs. <laughs> Oh, sorry for that. You guys, my allergies have been terrible. Just terrible the last, I don't know, week or so. It's it's really been... It's really been awful. If you don't have to deal with allergies, you are a blessed person. And, um... You have... My frustration. 
All right, let's put that there. We'll put the bombs there. Put the lucky lunch there that we'll eat once we get over that way. All right. And, um, yeah, I guess we'll just break these and wait for Pam to show up. Hey, a vertebrae. Not, not what we needed. I need a, a skull. Is that on the mountain? You know, I wonder. Let's just, real fast, let's just look over here. Rocks. Roots. Since we have to wait for Pam to show up, and that's not until 10 anyway. Maybe we just like run through and just look for artifact spots, you know? Maybe we'll get something super interesting. It's a high luck day after all. Okay, listen, a copper ore is not what we were hoping for. Okay. Oh, crystal fruit. I'll pick that up there. That will heal us as well. All right, so we lost probably about an hour doing that, but, you know, there, there was a chance that we could have found the item that we, we wanted, so... I feel like that's worth it. Oh, here's a spot, too. Wow, that's kind of awkward to get to, isn't it? Yes, to the desert. Well, that woodpecker's trying to eat something. I don't know what, but something. Wow, there are artifact spots everywhere here today. Okay, a beach warp. Okay, let's, uh, let's have our lunch. See if there's anything else around that we can snag. See anything there? I am glad for the cactus fruit. Great way to heal. Even though we did bring life elixirs, but... Cactus fruit, also a great thing to have with us. Is there anything else that we need? Really? No, I don't think so. Not even worth using a bomb on. Oh, this is worth. That was worth it. All right, and this will probably be worth it as well. We'll just drop a couple around, see what we find. It's hoping for a, what is that? One of those, you know, a tunnel thing, you know? Oh, here we go. Yes! Oh, that is awesome. Hey, mummy, come here. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's good stuff. Wow, did that wear off already? After 12 already? Thank goodness. Do, 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 do. You know, for a high luck day, this is a very low ratio of uh, holes to jump in so far. There's one. Okay, hey, we did get that. That's nice. There we go. Seven levels. Now, see, we're getting places. Oh, I have choices. Uh, this one. Maybe the other hole was better. I, I don't know. It's hard to say, you know. Oh, there's a thing right here. Okay. Ah, a staircase. 
I also would like the Omni Geodes, please. Ouch, that was my face. Don't mind me, just gonna eat some cactus fruit. And go down here. All right. I think this floor is going to take a hot minute. This, everything's kind of spread out, sadly. There we go. Ah! Yes, I would. Seven levels. Very good. Doing great. I'm just going to clear off this little top part with the pickaxe, and then we'll bomb. You know, hopefully there'll be concentration of stuff here a little bit lower down. And there is. Fabulous. health, huh? Should probably have something to take care of that, I suppose. Just uh, to be on the safe side. Don't want to don't want to die. Excuse me. I would like this rock. Thank you. Yeah, that's always the frustration when you're like, there has to be a staircase somewhere and you're, you know, you're breaking rocks frantically and then it turns out it's just already been revealed much further down onto the level than you've been. Uh, I'm also kind of focusing on trying to kill these uh, flying guys. Because um, that is one of the challenges at the Adventurer's Guild that we have not yet fulfilled. So, you know. We want we can. Level 40. Oh, there's a bat. Ah, it's a bat. That's not terrible, actually. Um, I need bat wings, so. We don't have 200. We have like 170 or something like that. Uh, it's not a lot. Why is there? Oh, boy, a slime egg. That, I suppose, makes sense now why there's a slime on this floor. That's funny. Oh my goodness. That is entertaining. Wow, nothing, huh? Okay. Still nothing! Although, that was fun. levels. I fell heal myself levels. That's what I fell. We have to kill a hundred mummies. A hundred. That's kind of a lot. Alright, let's grab some resources on this floor real fast. I saw the staircase. Don't worry. I just want to kill mummies. Okay. Let's see. What don't I need? I don't need that. Anything else in here I kind of don't need? Probably that slime egg, huh? I feel like I need that. And we'll grab some iridium, I suppose, since, you know, we are in the skull cavern. Die, die, die. Well, we're getting quite a few nodes now. That's good. I mean, you would hope so by the time you hit this floor, right? Should probably stop blowing myself up. That would probably... That would probably help us survive a little bit uh, better. 
inventory's full. Um, let's get rid of those. <gasps> I blew up the mushroom? Oh my gosh. I didn't even know that was possible. Okay, we've learned today that you can blow mushrooms up. Did anyone else know that? Friends, did you know that you could blow up a mushroom? Is that a thing that you knew? I was unaware that mushrooms were explodable. And that's really funny. But at the same time, kind of a bummer. I really wanted to pick it up. No. Oh, that was going to be some more bonus healing. It was going to be great, but not today. That's funny. All right. Death to more mummies, yes. Oh, the Crusader is so much fun. Highly recommend getting Crusader on your sword, friends. Uh, should you ever wish to go mummy slaying. It's a lot easier than just using bombs. You might be like, but Hilhum, you could be making it down so much farther into the mine. And I'm like, yeah, I could. But I don't know what happens when you kill enough mummies to get the reward. And I haven't looked it up, and I really want to know what it is. So we're just going to kill a lot of mummies. Also, there is a crazy amount of iridium on this floor, so that's a thing too. I was say, wait, we blew all that up and there wasn't a staircase? But yes, there was. Do we have room for that? We do. Cool. Ah, treasure floor. Very nice. An auto grabber. I, you know, as much as that is nice to have, I don't need it. I already have two. You know, I mean, I guess we'll bring it. Isn't that like our third one we found now or something? I, I feel like we have found another one already and it's in a chest just waiting to be used oh now we're to the iridium bats oh all right well that's fun and games of all sorts okay well i'm not gonna lie i really was hoping that there would be a staircase right there and of course it's already revealed Thanks, game. I appreciate you. We have found very, very few. Prismatic Shard! No. Darn. I was hoping for the Prismatic Shard. But alas. What does this give me? Attack? Oh, okay. Well. I mean, it's something, I suppose. Darn, no holes. I just want to jump down another couple of holes here, game. Well, you got to be like this, huh? I mean, my goodness. There's one. Three. That's it? Since we're here. Stop running out of speed. <laughs> we need speed. Ah, oh, goodness. Ah, a ghost. Hello, ghost friend. How are you today? Okay. Death to that guy. Hail some resources and go to the hole. Yes, 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 more of you. Yes, good. Oh, yeah, we are making progress today. Okay, 11 levels might have been a little painful. I'm not going to lie. That was kind of ouchy. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, he gave us one back. That was nice. Oh my gosh. 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 That's a lot of bats. Bats all have crazy amounts of health. <sighs> okay. <laughs> um, what don't I need? Hmm. Well, that's that's a good question. You know, I'm never going to do anything with that, so. We are just going to throw this down here and run away. Death to the bat. Run away. Whew. Discretion and valor and all that sort of thing. How much iridium do we have? 67. Hey, that's not bad. I mean, we're doing well as far as that goes. We haven't used that many bombs, honestly. Aha! Five more levels. Good stuff. I will take that one piece of iridium. Uh-oh. Bring it on. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, let's go. Nice. All right, what is this level? Oh, no, it's one of these. These are my most hated levels, honestly. These ones that just wind and wind around. Yes, I will jump down another, another hole. Okay, let's heal ourselves. All right, and then uh, let's proceed to uh, kill some stuff. Just these guys right here, these two. And then what we'll do is we'll, t we'll real fast, uh, we're just gonna get rid of this thing, even though it would heal us a super amount, but that's okay. We'll toss this, we'll toss this, and we have more than enough to make one of these, which we'll put down and just skip that floor because it's faster to do that. Not too bad, 92. On a very good luck day. No prismatic shards, though. That's a shame. I would have hoped by now that we would have found at least one prismatic shard. But we've not found any. I wonder if they just don't spawn if you blow it up using a bomb. That wouldn't surprise me. We are going to pass out in the mines, just so you all know. It only costs you $1,000. It's not a big deal. At this point in our lives, $1,000 is nothing. So, yeah. <laughs> Drop in the bucket, really. Oh, crops are ready. Nice. Okay. We don't have room for that at all. Oh, we did. <laughs> okay. Let's go put a bunch of stuff away. And we'll grab some coal. And we'll do this. Look at that. Good stuff. Okay, pine tar is ready. So I'm thinking, if I wanted another uh, shed, we could put it out here maybe, right? And then if we put down some flooring, I don't know that these rocks would spawn through the flooring. So, I mean, you could maybe use this quarry area, which honestly we really don't need anymore. As sort of like a shed area. And we could put our sheds down here. And again, I'm not sure if that would work or not, but... Again, sorry for that. Um, it, it could be very helpful. To try it, at least, you know. I don't know where to put this 
So I'm just going to throw it in there. Okay. I'm just going to go to all the chests and put stuff in there. I, you were found unconscious. Well, yes, yes, I was. You're not wrong. All right, we have some cloth. Put that away. We will take our lovely healing items and put those away. Those are pretty good for healing, too. Put our bombs and our geodes back where they go. Well, the bombs, anyway. Yeah, the geodes, too, I guess. I am um, trying to save these up to trade at the Desert Trader. There's, there's some things there that I would like to trade, so we're just going to put those there. Grab all of these. Give Abigail her morning amethyst. Good morning. Hey, headed out in the wild. I got you something. Oh, thank you so much. Use that if you get in a tough spot. It should help you. Oh, that's so nice of you. All right, let's put that stuff away. Put that away. Go over here. We're going to make some espressos. Delicious, delicious espressos. All right. Now, I have to go put the jade away. Anyway, my thought with the... With the shed, moving it down here, is that we have this warp thing, right? And we could just put the warp, I don't know, like here instead. And then, you know, it'd be easy to get over there. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, so we should probably go see Robin, I, I suppose. Yeah. Oh, uh, we should probably drink espresso first. There we go. Nice. And then, let's see, what else do we have to do? Um, we're going to have to harvest the greenhouse and get all of our ancient fruit. Keep our eyes peeled for artifact spots like this one. In the vain hope that we find a prehistoric skull somewhere. I believe it is on the mountain. Uh, up in this region. Uh, up by Robin's house, or maybe up by the spa, perhaps, that has it. I... I think that's where it's at in town, anyway. Hello, Robin. Good morning. Um, I would like to move some buildings. Can we Can we do that? Okay, first of all, we're going to move this one. I'm going to move it way down here, assuming you allow me to place it over here. That would be great. Oh, yes. Oh, this is, this is excellent. Okay, so let's put you right... Do I want it right there, maybe? Sure. Put that one right there. We could have a third one. Wouldn't that be interesting? Yeah, we could get like four in here probably. No, I think maybe just three. Nice. Is this shed not upgraded? I guess it isn't. Well, this is our wine shed, I think, so we should put that in the middle. And then I feel like... Let's see. What do I need for a shed? 300 wood. Uh, Robin, I would like to buy 300 wood, please. I mean, why have all this money if we never use it, you know? Why be rich to no good purpose? Let's build a shed. There we go. Yeah, let's build that thing. All right. Come on down. Downtown. There we go. Now that shed will be for... Uh, pineapple wine and eventually I'll probably need more sheds than that even if I'm being honest but. All right, Alex you're kind of in the way Alex Alex get, oh my gosh just move out my way boy just move 
Ugh. That is not what we were looking for. I suppose we could go over to the haunted cave and murder some skulls and hope we get lucky there, huh? I mean, I don't know that it'll help, but we could try. We could make an attempt. Uh, Alright, we have to get over to the island with our scythe today and check on our crops and um, the scythe is in case, you know, they're ready. Kind of an important uh, important thing to do. Okay. Now, let's drop some of this other stuff off here. Um, some of it should go over here. Hey, get in there. Wintertime stuff. All right, go down here. Okay, and then we're gonna move this. Gonna move this right up to here. There we go. And which one of these do we want? Um, I kind of want the brick floor, honestly. I like the brick floor. We'll grab some more clay so we can make more brick flooring. And I think we need stone too. Oh, wood is... No. Yeah, stone. There we go. Thought it was stone. There we go. Alright, let's go. Let's go cover this up. With these. We want some kind of design or some other kind of floor up here, maybe? See, it'd be cool. Is there a mod that, like, merges the different floor types together? That would be interesting. We're gonna need a lot. Okay, well. I'm not sure what else I'm gonna do up here. I'll probably put some trees or something in. Some kind of, you know, something that makes this look a little nicer up here. I don't know what exactly that will be yet, but I'll figure something out because the giant brick courtyard, probably not the most exciting thing we've ever done. I'll think about it. I'll mull it over. If you have some good suggestions, uh, feel free to uh, send them up. This is going to irk me. That, uh, it's not all the way there, but that's okay. I'll get over it. It'd be very hard to make that look symmetrical since we can't plant those bushes. And I don't think that we can... See one, two, three. Something like that. I mean that I think is the best we're getting. We see we can't chop these down, so. Yeah. Okay. But now we can warp back up. We go harvest all of our wine. Well. All of our fruit that will become wine. Anyway. And we have to grab our scythe and then we'll go over to the island. You know, I will say that there's a mod that uh, it's like the, the scythe harvest mod or something. Like that thing's amazing. Like, you just walk into the middle of all of your crops, like even berries like this and swing it and like everything gets harvested. Uh, I was watching my buddy Absurdum play with it the other day because he just started a Stardew Valley expanded playthrough on Twitch um, and he had that mod on and I was like wow that that is pretty handy that would save a, a lot of time a lot of time okay so we still need more kegs and casks maybe I don't recall how many casks we have in our basement we probably need casks too so basically we need wood uh, is what we need we need wood and hardwood and resin although I think we have a lot of resin and iron we need iron that's something else that we need uh, 
Okay, well, we certainly have lots of iridium bars now. 29 of them, in fact. You can't complain with 29 iridium bars, can you? Let's move all the stone out of here. Let's put the stone and uh, the clay and stuff in this container. Yeah, let's, let's make some more iron. I think we're going to need it. We're going to try and get two entire sheds full of... kegs. We're going to definitely need that. So... Okay, super speed. Here we go. Should be this nice middle one right here. There we are. And we'll grab all of these and we'll do the nice little switcheroo here. Put all of our ancient fruit into them, even the gold ones. Although, will we run out of kegs before fruit? That's a great question. I don't know. If I do, I suppose we can make other random fruit wine. That's gonna be close. Oh, we still had two left. Okay. Alrighty. That's not too shabby. Now, running up here, do we have anything in these? We do. Alright. So those are doing their thing. Very good. Go over here. We'll just sell. We'll sell the fruit for the day. Sell the wine. Sell that. Sell those. Look in here. Is there anything that we need to bring with us? No. Uh, the side, though. We have to find that. Where have I placed you, scythe? Here we are. Very good. To Willy's! Aha! We did not sell the mango. In case we run into Leo. Uh, Leo likes mangoes. Although, I will say he is kind of hard to find. Excepting those times when he's, like, just chilling on the main thing. You know what? It's not even worth my time. There was still no lobster. <sighs> Maybe I will move one over to the right. Hey, Willie, I know you were trying to go somewhere, but, like, could you be a bro and take me to the island? Thanks. <laughs> Poor Willie. He just can't go anywhere. Every time he leaves, I'm like, how about now would be a great time to go over to the island, and he's just like, I guess. <laughs> Poor guy. Feel bad for him. Well, that's interesting. There's no sound of rain, even though it's raining. Okay, here we go. Like, see, look how much faster this is. This is amazing. Could you imagine doing this with every crop? Like, for real. Think about how much time you would save if you did that, you know, if you could do that for every crop. Ugh. I mean, honestly. Okay. Pineapples. Hey, we got some hay. That's cool. Alright, let's go drop this off. Over in the chest, we have successfully taken care of that. Yellow items are now completed. There we go. We had one extra. Okay, so now we just need the purple uh, amaranth to get done. And we're good. Excellent. Um, could we hit the ginger? That'd be awesome. There we go. Four. Another five. Okay. Now then, we'll run up this way. 
check up here. Sometimes they're here. No. The dig site. There's often ginger at the dig site. Yes. Hey. There we go. And as we have recently learned, there is often ginger above the dig site as well. That is the wrong part of a dead animal. I need a skull. I need a skull. Ah. Ginger over here today? No? Darn. Sometimes there's a bunch right here. It's apparently rare, I guess. Who knew? All right, well, let's just run in and... Ow, I got slimed. I need to kill those guys still, too. Not a lot of them, but some. All right. Yes, please, just stay there. Thank you. I appreciate. So we're not going to stay in here super long, but maybe we can get a cinder shard or two. It would be something. Or we can get completely stymied by lava on all sides, and that would be a bummer. There's some slimes. Not exactly exciting. Aha! There's one. Alright, we got we got a shard. It's better than nothing. We should probably go back down here and take care of this little underground gang. There we go. Triple shot espresso and cinder shards. I'll call that a good a good trip. I think in the next episode, maybe what we'll do is we'll do a run through the volcano after we search the island for ginger, and we will try to get enough cinder shards to put the last aquamarine into the sword. That's the, that's the hope anyway. All right, what can we sell? Honestly, we don't need a lot of this. There we go. Get rid of several items there. Okay. The rest of this can stay in the inventory. Uh, we might end up with more of it through our various shenanigans. Hey, is there a kitchen in here? Hey, look at that. I would like to make an espresso, please. Thanks. You know, I should really buy one of those, uh... Little decorate your house things, I suppose. Yeah, probably should. Well, that'll do it. Go to sleep, yes. And we made a ton of money. Thanks to our super nice, super friendly, super great ancient fruit wine. About a quarter mil. Doing great. That turned out very well. Ooh, progress has been saved. Excellent. Well, friends, I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Stardew Valley. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. But until then, take care, and we'll see you next time.